Chapter 3, Digital Vision, Purpose and Characteristic Go therefore and make disciples of all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, teaching them to observe all that I commanded you, and lo, I am with you always, even to the end of the age. Matthew 28, 19-20 the purpose of the digital vision is to complete the Great Commission. The purpose of the digital vision, now that you know about the regions of the digital vision, I would also like to share the purpose of the digital of the vision with you. Some people think about doing the ministry for some sort of personal recognition, but the only true reason for doing the ministry is to ministries to extend the work of God. The only purpose of the digital vision is to fulfill the Great Commission and in so doing, lift up the name of Jesus. The vision is the tool the Lord entrusted to us to enlarge His kingdom and His name, not our own. It is for this reason that our doors have always been open for the vision to be taught to anyone who desires to run with it, because we understand that it is something that belongs to the whole body of Christ. Characteristic of the digital vision. The vision has some essential characteristic that you need to acknowledge in order to apply them correctly. The G12 vision. Pastor the multitude, win souls and make disciples, make every member a leader, show compassion to people, reproduce Jesus' teaching, exercise authority over the enemy. 1. Win souls and make disciples. We know that teaching new people with the message of salvation is essential to the work of the ministry. The digital vision helps us to achieve this purpose and to go on to form disciples. Remember that a true disciple is not one who simply attends church or makes a confession of faith, but rather someone who truly really follows in Christ's footsteps. To make every member a leader, the digital vision allows every member through a proper process of formation to become a committed leader within the ministry who develops the gifts and calling that the Lord has given them. Having strong leadership in turn strengthens the whole church and share the weight of the ministry equally. Number three, show compassion to people. Jesus was the first to feel compassion for people and the way in which he demonstrated this was by coming in person to meet the needs of all. Seeing the people, he felt compassion for them because they were distressed and dispirited like sheep without a shepherd. Matthew chapter 9, verse 36. Today, the situation is not similar. People are lost with so many problems and, and on the edge of the abyss. We should always seek to meet every one of these needs that digital vision allows us to pastor people personally in order to meet the needs of each person and heal everyone. The digital vision express the compassion of God through every leader who is committed to, do, to the work. Number four, reproduce Jesus' teaching. Through discipleship, the digital vision reproduces the character of Christ in every new believer. These new believers learn and apply every one of Jesus' teachings, becoming faithful disciples, ready to teach others. 5. Exercise authority over the enemy. The Word teaches us the Son of God and appeared for this purpose, to destroy the works of the devil. 1 John 3, 8. I also say to you that you are Peter, and upon this rock I will build my church, and the gates of Hades will not overpower it. Matthew chapter 16, verse 18. These signs will accompany those who have been believed in my, in my name. They will cast out demons. They will speak with new tongues. They will pick up serpents. And if they drink any deadly poison, it will not hurt them. They will lay hands on the sick and they will recover. Mark chapter 16 verse 17 to 18. Jesus established a powerful church against which the enemy cannot stand. However, we often find believers who live as though they had been defeated. The digital vision teaches every believer the truth of the word so that they can live in victory and exercise authority over the adversary. Number six, pastor the multitudes. When a church begins to grow, it becomes difficult for people to connect with the pastor directly or to receive counsel at the right moment. This can often result in people leaving the church or in them being like sheep without a shepherd. 
Digital vision trains leaders to pastor people in a personal, direct, genuine, and complete way, where every new person can find their place and also receive direction and timely instruction. It is the only way to pastor the multitudes effectively.